Ever wonder why Minecraft XP levels don't actually do anything? Anything beyond enchanting, anyway. I turned your XP bar into a real power system. Imagine getting buffs and auras as you get higher in levels. Imagine no longer. Alright everybody, this one is actually pretty simple. The entire premise of this is built around a single piece of command language. Uh, and we're gonna go through here, I'll walk you through a rudimentary system I made just to show it to you. This is set up for an increase at level 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. Now you can set this up or use this however you want, but by the end of this, you will have the knowledge to do it yourself. All right, so now I am level 10, and as you can see, on the right side of my screen, I now all of a sudden have a status effect. That is thanks to this command here. Inside the command block, repeating always active, I'm doing slash execute as at a lm equals 10. Now many of you are like, wait, LM? I've used R and I've used RM. We've even used C on occasion. I've never seen LM. LM means level minimum. We have target selectors that you can use that actually check for what level the players are that you're looking at. So I'm executing as any player that's at least level 10 at their location. Run effects. It's going to give them strength 1-1 one, one, true. So when you are level 10, you get this basic strength increase, right? You know, you're still pretty low level, but hey, you know what? That, that's a pretty good increase to your damage. All right, next up, we're going to go from level 10 to level 20. Bam. Yep, level 20. And now I have two status effects on the side. So the first one here is going to be very similar, except for execute as at a LM equals 20, because it's minimum level. Now, if you're over 20... Um, we're gonna run this and since this is a higher strength value than the first one I don't even have to stop the first one. This one's gonna overwrite it. So net it won't do anything It, it, it works just fine um, Even if the other one continues what you can do if you don't want the other one to run unnecessarily for example like for this one it starts at level 20, but I also would I could put an N so L equals 29 so now minimum level is 20 max level is 29 so this wouldn't run if I get to 30 but either way this is gonna give us strength 2 instead of strength 1 and now chain conditional always active we have a very similar setup here we're gonna give us speed 1 1 so now once you reach level 20 you get even stronger and you start getting faster all right now I've brought us up to level 30 and at level 30 is when you begin to start getting some auras start getting a little stronger the level 30 is a nice gentle green aura but it's still pretty cool and now you'll see that we have speed we have strength and we have jump boost so the first one here we're gonna do that same setup except for LM is 30 we're gonna do strength 3 coming in here we're gonna do speed 2 again that's LM 30 because now we're at the level 30 here we go jump boost just like I said and you'll see that the ones that we introduced early were just gradually raising up every time and then introducing something else now for the aura on this one the first one we have here repeating always active with a 30 tick delay and we're gonna execute at a L equals 39 LM equals 30 so only between 30 and 39 at at s we're gonna run particle minecraft crop growth emitter tilde tilde 0.5 tilde so change to that one almost the exact same thing the only difference is we're going to change the location instead of tilde tilde 0.5 it's tilde tilde 1.5 so we're doing two different particle effects to create this one all right now at level 40 we get an even cooler aura one that's starting to show that you're, you're, you're emanating power and again we get a new status effect now we have resistance added to the list up there on the screen so this is actually going to be the biggest line, and I'm going to show you exactly why here shortly, but let's take a look here. We're going to run the same type of setup. LM is 40 for this one, and now we're doing strength 4. We got speed 3. Jump boost 1. Resistance 1. 
Now we're also doing saturation. Uh, this one doesn't show up on the side, but now you don't have to eat food. Your hunger stays satiated, which is pretty cool. And then for the uh, the aura on this one, repeating always active, we're going to do an 8 tick delay. Execute as at A, L equals 49, LM equals 40. So between 40 and 49. At our location, run particle Minecraft trial spawner detection, tilde negative 0.5, tilde, tilde negative 0.5. Those are because the... The, this particular particle and the one we're going to do at level 50, uh, the location you type in is actually where the corner of the particle is. It's not the center. So I'm just centering it off on your person instead of having it all weirdly offset. All right. Now at level 50, we have an even cooler aura. This one just is, to me, is like divine energy. You know what I mean? It glows similar to like the beacon or like the, uh, the, the, the sea lantern. I've, I've always liked that light blue kind of glow. Um, so this is what you get at level 50. And then let's take a look at the commands. So a lot of the abilities on this one are going to stay the same. You get the same strength level. We're going to increase your resistance. You're going to keep the same speed. So these still run, remember, right? The way that I set it up, these are still running. So you keep a lot of those, but you get a higher resistance. And now you get regeneration, okay? These kick in with LM50. And so now you have a 260% increase in strength. You're like got almost twice as fast as you were originally. You can jump two blocks high or like five blocks across if you're sprinting. Uh, you reduce the damage you take by about half. And then even then you regenerate your health twice as fast as you normally would. And you have a cool aura. If you want to take your command block skills even further, you need to check out the Level Up with Command Blocks workshop. The waitlist is open now and the early spots go fast. It's a hands-on series designed to turn you into a real command block wizard. No fluff or long tutorials, just you and the project. Click the link in the description or pinned comment to join the list and be the first to know when we go live. Level up your Minecraft, level up your commands.